Welcome to my YouTube channel Mechanical Magic Mechanical Learning Tutorials. So in this video I would like to solve the one of the examples at constant pressure process. So just referring the data and evaluating the problems a gas whose pressure, volume and temperature are 2.75 bar 0.09 meter cube and 185 degree centigrade respectively so just I would like to write down the given data like that P1 that will be equal to 2.75 bar so that will be converting into Pascal 2.75 into 10 raised to 5 Pascals and the given volume that will be at point number 1 or initial condition so V1 that will be equal to 0.09 meter cube and a temperature 185 degree centigrade so T1 185 degree centigrade so now that will be converting into the Kelvin so T1 that should be equal to 458 degree Kelvin now for the further data has the state change at constant pressure until its temperature becomes 15 degree centigrade so that will be the temperature T2 so T2 that will be 15 degree centigrade so that will, should be converting into Kelvin so T2 equal to 2.88 degree Kelvin so first calculate heat transfer so Q work done by the system W and third change in internal energy and some more data is also given here R is equal to 0 0.29 kilo joule per kg Kelvin so generally that value of R it should be converting into joule per kg Kelvin so here R is equal to 0.29 kilo joule per kg Kelvin so that should be converting into 0 0.29 into 10 raised to 3 joule per kg Kelvin and value of CP is already given to you 1.005 kilo joule per kg Kelvin now I want to draw a PV diagram for same system so here from the X axis that will be representing as a volume Y axis that should be pressure so as from the given data constant pressure process so always that should be constant so P1 equal to P2 so here it will be the point number 1 and point number 2 at constant pressure process so as from the given data P1 equal to P2 that should be equal to 2.75 bar and the temperature 185 and that will be converting into Kelvin so 458 degree Kelvin for the point number 1 for similarly point number 2 for the pressure that should be constant temperature T2 15 degree centigrade so that will be 2.288 degree Kelvin and as per the data volume at point number 1 V1 and that will be equal to 0 0.09 meter cube and V2 we have to find out it will be not given into the data now as from the given data I would like to find out with the help of R is equal to CP minus CV here the value of R is given to you and value of CP that should be given to you so with the help of these two value I would like to find specific heat at constant volume and that will be 0 0.715 kilojoule per kg Kelvin. Now from the characteristics gas equation and that will be PV equal to MRT and apply for the point number 1. So P1 V1 equal to MRT1. So with the help of these equations I would like to find mass of the gas. So P1 V1 upon RT1 just put the value and you will get the answer 0 0.186 kg. Now for the constant pressure process I would like to apply P1 V1 upon T1 equal to P2 V2 upon T2 combined gas flow. But over here you can say constant pressure so P1 equal to P2. So finally you will get V1 upon T1 that will be equal to V2 upon T2 if you equalize with the V2 and put the value so you will get the answer V2 that will be equal to 0 0.057 so here 0 
फाइव सेवन मीटर क्यूब राइट सो नाउ सेकंड वर्क डन बाय द सिस्टम सो वर्क डन मींस पी इनटू वी टू माइनस वी वन तो जस्ट पुट द वैल्यू ऑफ पी एंड दैट विल बी टू पॉइंट सेवेंटी फाइव इनटू टेन रेस्ट टू फाइव पास्कल इनटू वी टू माइनस वी वन सो यू विल गेट द आंसर लाइक माइनस 9076 joule so that will be indicating the minus value so the interpretation of this work done is on the system right so minus is indicating that work done is on the system now for the first one heat transferred so generally heat transferred at a constant pressure process so here q is equal to m c p delta t so just put the value of m that will be from here c p that will be given to you and t1 and t2 so all the values that will be from the data and you will put and get the answers and that will be indicating minus 31.75 kilo Joule. Once again, that will be having a minus value. So that means what? Heat is rejected by the system. And the final change in internal energy. So delta U that will be equal to m c v delta t. So just put the value of mass specific heat at constant value. And that will be fine with the help of relation of R C P minus C V and C V equal to point seven one five, and put the value of the temperature difference, and you will get minus twenty two point sixty one kilo joule. So this is your simple examples for finding of the heat transferred, work done, and internal energy of the system. Thank you very much.